So, at present, this is the nook where I fix pens and play with pens and sell pens, maybe, if I ever can do that. And this is the desk that I added the IKEA casters to so that I can easily, with the touch of a finger, move this around so I can get my fat butt through the Kyber Pass here and then sit down at my desk. So and then I would move this closer to me and in here would be maybe trays of pens for sale. If you, or you or you or you, wanted to buy a pen from me, I would probably turn this around, give you a chair where you could write on the slanted surface, and I would sit here and find pens in my collection of things for sale for you to try out. But because you're not here, that was my cat, I can just snugly fit this right here. Trying to do this without um, a problem. And here's my iPad, I mean my iPhone holder upper, which is there we go. No, I can actually no. There. And look, I can turn this on, blinding myself. Let's just see if we can make this work. So this no yes I'd have to do maybe I'd do this. Hold on, let's see if this works. Testing one, two, three. Let's see if this works. No. Yes. Now Turn it off. Turn that off. <gasps> Turn this on. Move that over. It's turned on already. God damn it. <sighs> My life is still a disaster. Okay, let's see if it works. Let me get a piece of, piece of paper right here. Get a pen. One, two, three. I feel like I'm a child in a high chair because the desk I'm sitting on where I would normally be sitting. Actually, this stool is a piano stool, so I can raise it up a little bit. Um, but right now, the here's my fat butt, my elbow, and my head. Normally the desk would have been here, but because I've added that much casterage and height to it, it's now here. So my writing desk is so much closer to my my double chin that it's not entirely natural but what I'm thinking there's just something that my little brain cells are remembering when I was in grade school sitting at a desk that was two I guess they all were adjustable back then those hideously ugly desks that were made of there's a chair here and then a thing like that. And there's a little peer, shy little peer looking down at his desk so the teacher wouldn't see him. Here, can you explain the Dewey Decimal System? 
or whatever I was supposed to do. Here's my little like, feet. So I, you know, my, I'm bigger now. My chins are bigger and more numerous. And um, so I'm a little higher up in my, the desk is a little higher up than I normally would like. But I think it works fine for what I do here, which is to fix pens. And the closer my eyeball is to the to the um, nib, probably the better it is for me to do my job. But I do have over here this table is more at the height that I normally would. work at. So, la di da. Now, let's see if I, you can watch me as I try to move this desk out of the way because everything is upside down here. There, see? It moves easily. I just have to make sure that I don't... I probably won't do any more moving than what you just saw right there. Because uh, this is mainly just to allow me to get back into my little booth here. This is cool, this little thing here. Well, whatever was in it. <laughs> it had all sorts of things in it, which are now in this drawer, in the room, on the floor. I don't know where they are. <laughs> they used to be here, but when I turned it upside down, everything fell down. So this would have held your pens and your inkwell. Isn't that cool? Oops. That's where they are. How am I supposed to get them? How the hell am I supposed to get them out of there? Do I have to turn it upside down again? It's so difficult being me. Well, this is a nice... I should have just... Why couldn't I have just taken... Taken them out. See, they're back behind there somewhere, and I don't think there's a way to get at it from the bottom. So what I have to do is turn it upside down. It's like it's like getting pennies out of the bank. Could I have any better light here? It's like getting pennies out of a bank when you lost the key, the piggy bank, and you have to shake it upside down until maybe one penny falls out. And then two pennies get stuck, jammed, and you can't do it. You have to push them back in. Anyway, wish me luck.